Usually I'm behind the camera, but today I'm subbing in for E. So anyways, I got to check out the 2024 Chevrolet Equinox EV. Here's a quick look and my first impressions. With the starting price of $30,000 on the 1LT trim, Chevrolet is aiming this line to be more in the affordable price range. The model that I got to check out is the LT version. This is a demo car, so I didn't get a chance to drive it. But when I first saw it, the two-tone look does stand out. I do like the blue and white combo. There is a black roof available, but that's only on RS trim. Personally, I think the red and black option is pretty common out there versus the blue and white. For the design, it's pretty bold and edgy and sportsy as well. For the headlights, they are slim and sleek and it does match the car very well. With these lights, they do have animations, whether you're walking to the car or walking away. I like that visual cue to know that the car knows you're leaving. So it's nice to not having to press the lock key 10 times to make sure that the car is locked. And these animations would happen with the front and back lights. For the wheels, they are 19 inches, but depending on the trim, you can go up to 21 inches. I didn't get to see the trunk working since it wasn't fully operating, but it does have sensors in the back to know that you're there. So you don't have to wave your feet under the car to open the trunk door, it knows that you're there already. Now moving to the inside, you do also get the two-tone look on the seats, and they are a mixture of cloth and leather. When I sat on it, it did wrap around me pretty well, so it was pretty comfortable. With the infotainment system layout, it's pretty similar to the Blazer EV where there's a panel in front of you and then there's one besides it. In this specific model, this screen is 17 inches. And also, it's slightly angled to the driver, so it's very easy to look at. Another thing that was mentioned to me was ambient lighting. Behind these blue panels, light do come through and it will look very nice during nighttime where you can choose what specific light you want. So that is a very nice personal touch to have when you're riding this car at night. One interesting thing about the Super Cruise mode is they have sensors on the steering wheel to see that if you're actually paying attention to the road or looking at something else. The steering wheel is also heated so that's super handy during winter time along with the windshield and the seats in the back. Now moving on to the back seats, they are spacious for me since I'm about 5'8 and you do have options to control how strong you want the heated seats to be. And below that, you do get two USB-C ports to charge their devices. There are two more USB-C ports in the front along with wireless charging. The car does have a lot of safety features like reverse automatic braking. And as time goes, safety features do get updated and you do get that for free. There are a lot of other little things like a bigger heads-up display so you can see a lot more information and more details in terms of direction when you're using GPS. And the rear view mirror is also a viewfinder for your back camera as well. One pedal driving is standard throughout the cars, meaning that once you let go of the gas, the car will slowly brake until it completely stops. And there's a setting to control how strong you want that to be. In terms of range, the highest you can get is around 300 miles. Of course, that depends on what driving system you have. And for charging, there is an animation for that, so that's a big plus. And with the standard DC fast charging, you can get about 70 miles in 10 minutes. Chevrolet does have a limited time warranty that covers the battery for 8 years or 100k miles. So it's nice to have a peace of mind that the battery is covered for a very long time. With the lineup of the Blazer EV, the Silverado EV, and now the Equinox EV, Chevrolet has a huge area covered in terms of price range for the consumers looking into the EV market. The Chevrolet 2024 Equinox EV will be available in fall of 2023. Starting off with the limited edition 2 RS trim. So hopefully we get to test drive this in the future. If you want to see more of me, I'll put my socials on the screen. Thanks for watching and always enjoy entertainment.